In these difficult times that we do live in, with all the chaos that is taking place all around the world, in almost every country that you can think of, with a lack of knowledge of what is actually taking place and how we should be preparing, this is a quick list of my 20 top items, in my opinion, that everybody should have to make sure that you are prepared for you and your family because we do not know what is going to be taking place. Number one, a water filtration system. A portable water filter or purification tablets to ensure access to clean drinking water, which is crucial and key to survival in any situation. Water is number one. Number two, non-perishable food. A supply of high calorie, long lasting food items like canned goods, freeze dried meals, and energy bars are crucial for maintaining energy levels and helping you make good quality decisions for you and your family. Number three, a first aid kit. A well stocked first aid kit helps treat injuries, and prevent infections in a time of need. Number four, a multi-tool, very critical. A reliable multi-tool with various functions such as a knife, screwdriver, a can opener is essential for various tasks in a survival type situation. You never know what you're gonna run across. Number five, a fire starter. A waterproof lighter or matches along with a magnesium fire starter for starting fires is crucial for warmth, cooking, and signaling. Also, can help purify your water if you need to boil it. Number six, shelter. A lightweight, durable tent or tarp can provide protection from the elements and help maintain your body temperature. You don't want to be getting wet or being out in the cold or anything else, so even just having a tarp and you can set that up this way here you can get some shelter and you get out of the elements. Number seven, navigation tools. A compass, maps are very vital for finding your way, especially when electronic devices may not be functional. So having some maps of your area, like I've talked about, and a compass and know how to read a compass will help you navigate your way. Number eight, sturdy clothing. Durable, weather-appropriate clothing and footwear are a necessity for protection against harsh conditions. You gotta make sure you have stuff that's waterproof, windproof, and these type of things so that it will keep you warm and dry if things or the weather changes. Number nine, a communication devices. A battery-powered or hand crank radio is always the best. It allows you to receive emergency broadcasts and stay informed during these disasters on what is taking place and maybe where to go. Number 10, a flashlight. A reliable waterproof flashlight or headlamp helps with visibility during nighttime or low light situations when you need to see to do something with your hands. Number 11, paracord. This strong, lightweight cord has a lot of different uses, including securing shelters, creating makeshift tools, and constructing traps for food. Paracord is very, very important. It's very strong. Number 12, personal protection. Depending on the situation, having a means of self-defense, like pepper spray, a firearm, or a sturdy knife can be crucial depending on the situation that is at hand. Number 13, signaling devices. If you're looking to try to find a way to make people aware of where you are, a whistle or a signal mirror or flare can help attract attention and communicate your location to rescuers. So having some of these things, if you wanna be rescued, is very, very important. Number 14, Emergency blanket. A compact, reflective emergency blanket helps conserve body heat and can serve as an imposed shelter also, but it also can keep you warm inside of a shelter if you have one. 
Wrap yourself up in it and you'll be good to go. Number 15, duct tape. Now duct tape has numerous applications. We all know that, right? From fixing gear to creating makeshift tools, duct tape can patch holes in tarps, holes in your shelter. It can help hold things together. There's just many things that duct tape is good for. Number 16, a fishing kit. A compact fishing kit with hooks, line, and sinkers can help supplement your food supply. If you're around a body of water, a lake, a stream, a river, or anything like this, you can always slip rocks and stuff over to find uh, worms or crickets or something. Having a small little compact fishing kit is very key to helping up your food supply. Number 17, a sewing kit. A small sewing kit allows you for repairing your clothing, your gear, or creating a makeshift tool. You know, I mean, there's several different things that you can use with a sewing kit. Number 18, a portable solar charger. A solar charger helps keep essential electronic devices charged when traditional power sources are unavailable. So if you have something that's portable, small, compact, these things you can always just take and just put those right in your backpack and this way here you can charge up your flashlights um, your radios maybe your cell phone or whatever else and this way you always have power 19 personal hygiene this is just basic hygiene supplies people this is just like your toothbrush toothpaste soap toilet paper all this kind of stuff can help prevent illness and maintain morale and that's very important in a survival type situation, no matter what it is. And number 20 is cash and important documents. A stash of cash and small dominations, along with copies of essential documents, like your ID, passport, insurance policies, prescriptions, all this kind of stuff, can be invaluable during crisis when navigating the bureaucratic process of trying to prove who you are and what you need and everything else so that's been my top 20 in my opinion that everybody needs to make sure that you are stocked up on thank you for joining me today on this video you all stay safe you keep prepping we're gonna need these things if you see them on sale buy them if not if you have more questions go to my amazon storefront they're all right there take your pick catch you on the flip side